Hey my friends, welcome to Joey's Tech. In this video, I will show you how to install Pandas library in Visual Studio Code. So this is my Visual Studio Code. It's already open. First, what we are going to do, we are going to create a Python project folder using Visual Studio Code. Then we are going to create a virtual environment within it. And then we will install Pandas library in that virtual environment by activating it. Okay. So let's start with step number one, which is creating our Python project folder. So what I'm going to do, I am going to click on file and then I'm going to click on open folder. I'm going to go inside my desktop here. I'm going to create a new folder and uh, let's call it pandas vs code, pandas underscore vs code. Let me click on create. All right, I have it created. You can see it's selected. I'm going to open it in Visual Studio Code. There you go, it's open. All right, so I'm going to create a Python file within this folder, okay, first, and I'm going to write some pandas code within it, okay? So let me call it main.py, and let me write some pandas code. So I am going to write import pandas as pd so i am importing pandas and let me create a dictionary so using that dictionary i'll create a data frame so let me quickly do that let me call that dictionary t equals to curly brackets for dictionary then uh, i will be putting in two key value pairs inside this dictionary so first key will be name and uh, the value will be a list and uh, let there be two names within this list so let one be sort of and uh, let the other one be Sachin. Let me create the other key value pair. Uh, let it be city. And uh, the value of uh, city will be um, Kolkata. It's a list within which there are two values. So Kolkata and Mumbai. All right. Now I'm going to create a data frame. And uh, this data frame I'm going to create using pandas data frame function. All right, so to this data frame function, I'm going to pass this dictionary T and then I'm going to print the data frame. All right, so let me run this. Let me run this uh, in Python using terminal. Let me see if it works. It doesn't work. It says no module named pandas. So this means that uh, pandas is not yet installed in, in this folder pandas underscore VS code. So now, like I said earlier, we'll be creating a virtual environment and the command to do that is this Python 3 hyphen M V and V that stands for virtual environment. And we are going to now give the name of the virtual environment. So let's call it uh, pandas uh, underscore V and V. All right. I hit enter. Then we can say that pandas underscore V and V is successfully created and uh, you see there is no error encountered and uh, you can see pandas underscore v and v folder over here these are the folders which get created when we create a virtual environment so now we are going to activate it how to activate it so we are going to type source then uh, pandas underscore v and v forward slash bin and forward slash activate so within bin there is this activate file that we are calling Okay, so I hit enter. You can see that pandas underscore venv is activated now. All right, and now we are going to install pandas. So the command is simple it will be pip3 install pandas. All right, I hit enter, and the installation has begun. It will take a few seconds, but it will be installed very soon it's installing numpy as well you can see it over here all right so installation of pandas is complete it says so now we are going to test the installation of pandas by the way you can select different python interpreters before installing pandas from here okay for me there are many python versions installed in my mac so they are appearing different interpreters from different versions of python are appearing over here but i have selected the recent one the most recent one which is 3.12.2 all right let's test the installation of pandas so that yellow line beneath pandas is gone so i assume that pandas is successfully installed but let's test it by running this command so i'm going to again click on run 
Python file in terminal and it should give me the data frame awesome there I have my data frame created all right this means that we have successfully installed pandas in this pandas underscore vs code folder okay so let me reiterate we first created a virtual environment activated it and then installed pandas all right we have come to the end of this video i hope you enjoyed learning how to install pandas in visual studio code from this tutorial of joey stick i'll see you in the next video till then goodbye and take very good care of yourself